I think an infectious diseases pharmacist does many things, but most simply, we focus on the safe and effective care of patients using antibiotics. The best and easiest way to describe my job is Think of me as the medication guy, as it relates to all kinds of infectious diseases. So infectious diseases pharmacists can interact with patients in a variety of different ways if you're in the hospital when they're admitted. And then, you know, we do have infectious diseases pharmacists who work in clinics. I think an ID pharmacist can supplement the role of a physician, one, by helping them come up with the, you know, the treatment plan. The ID pharmacist is advocating for my patient by making sure that the antibiotic that's being prescribed is optimal and safe for the patient. A patient who's hospitalized that would like to speak with a pharmacist, the most simple way to do that is just to ask. I think the physician would love that, honestly, right? It shows that the patient is engaged in their care and they're trying to get the right information. The more informed people are, the more willing they are to participate in their own care. The pharmacist is always there. We have overseen the medications that that patient is receiving. We are talking with the physician. So even though the patient might not talk to the pharmacist face to face, we have overseen every aspect of their care in the hospital. But, you know, patients should definitely feel empowered to talk to different members of the healthcare team. ID pharmacists frequently are helping patients with education, usually by writing large-scale uh, patient information that is distributed at the hospital or the community level. I educate patients by helping them uh, understand information in various ways through printed material, through talking, having a conversation with them. Reviewing literature helps you make evidence-based decisions about how you're going to treat patients. A typical relationship with my patients starts in the clinic where I sit down face to face with a patient. But this relationship continues as we establish long-term relationships by coordinating medication deliveries or refills. The experience that I believe that I get from having a pharmacist in clinic is where my questions are gonna be answered. Knowing that he's gonna be able to, you know, uh, satisfy whatever the problem might be dealing with medication or knowledge of it, for me, that's great. I am grateful that there is a pharmacist in clinic and I'm hoping that more clients who come in are made aware of that. Having a more personal relationship with patients is quite important and one of the most satisfying parts of my job, I would say. Honestly, it's the best part of my job getting to interact with patients. We are here and we are available and, and very interested in talking to our patients to be able to learn about the patient's lives and their families and what they do. Uh, they're part of my life.